okay so i'm going to go to noon now we'll start the screwdriver tutorials first create new files and look for your print and speed design workbench you need the part as a screwdriver by renaming the part one the properties okay so we'll rename this screwdriver and this one to handle we'll post this part design close this previous files start mechanical design that's uh, why you and speed design okay new files so rename this into screwdriver and product okay and we rename this into handle so make the set we rename this into handle like this and Okay. Next is create five plane which shown offset below. Use create plane icon. So the first plane is twenty. Next twelve, and then twenty, twenty five, and eleven. So start with twenty. Okay, and twelve. Okay. Uh, next is 20 and 35 20 so as you can see I select the plane which means that it, this will be the the direction and also the offset from this plane 35 and 11 last plane is 11 Okay, so we'll make this fit all in. Then, click circle icon and windows will definitely will appear. Select center and radius as circle type. Center and radius as circle type. Done. Right click in the center box and select create point. Point, and then we'll point to the list. Select point. 0, 0, and 0, and select OK. So, center, create point. Just now is a previous version, so this is the latest version. So, just now I right click and click point definition. So, we'll select 0, 0, and 0. Preview. So, it'll be there. Okay. Select the explain as support plane. So support is X X plane. Insert 9 mm in radius field. Select whole circle as circle and then select OK. So it be 9 mm and selecting this we create a circle at the Z X plane with 9 mm radius. Preview. OK. So this is our first circle. Use on plane point to points on plane 1 to 1 and 2 and center for 11 and 19 mm radius so we'll create 11 and 9 mm radius center create point 0 0 0 support this will be plane point 1 radius eleven mm okay so now you can see this play this circle is not on this so we create it on that one so the one we want this to be geometry on support Click it so it will be here. Okay, and we can see that our circle is not smooth. So we can go to options under display and performance and reduce this to minimum and minimum. Minimum. Also, this table of details. 
already have smoother circles so next we need to continue to create new circle that is 9mm create circle click center, no center, create point 0, 0, 0, ok support is this plane you may see it support so this is 9 9 mm ok sketch this profile on plane 3 so this is plane number 3 construct two personal line that are perpendicular to the base and select intersection point icon so this is two lines and ok so what we want to do is sketch this profile on plane T so this is a rectangular with the T on sides and the T on each end the T so we will sketch using sketch plane ok so I double click this so that we don't have to repeat just click it and click here so I will click to deactivate change this to 30 change this to 30 and change this to 30 ok so I want to have the center point So this will be center line. So this uh, this line we need it to to have our uh, points by intersections. Okay, so we need to select one by one. Select this one and two. So it will automatically create center point of that triangle this coincidence will coincide between these two points ok and then we'll put in the radius 3 on each edge radius 3 we can use this Again, and so we change this to three. Done. So we need to. Uh, right click on construction point and set definition show me the select as construction element so we need to change this point into construction element otherwise it cannot be uh, proceed to next uh, process so click click here this one this point you need to click to construction element and close so this point will be converted into construction points so now we want to move to step number 6 select the sketch icon select plane 4 so exit sketch so this is our plane number 4 so this step will show you how we want to copy the, the previous profile that we have made select each field to try your profile by using control click and select project 3 elements set will be selected to project the elements then isolate the lines okay, like this and click and together I hold the control button on keyboard so we will project 3D elements this icon so we will project the elements to the planes that we have selected previously so this is the line and it's activate so if I click anywhere so it will show that the line is yellow 
so here I must select one by one line or you can also mark one object and how to search then you want to select the object I saw it so you convert the line into white and we have copied the profile from previous planes now on step number 7 make a circle on plane 5 with 16 mm in diameter using previous method so now we are halfway to create screwdriver handle alright so I click sketch so we want to create a plane a sketch here you can use sketch 16 mm in diameter so if you use sketch like this 16 mm diameter you need to make sure this point and this center of the zero, zero is coincide okay that's it we are halfway making the handles now select my surface icon and select circle 1 until up to this curves and replace the closing point for the two triangle which should be shown vision below check the vision box image surface smoother select ok so you want to select this icon click 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 the triangles second triangles ok just now in the tutorial just advised that the closing point is located almost similar points here so this is okay this is okay okay this is okay so this one should be need to be replaced to here so how right click here and replace and click here okay so if we click before we click preview we need to click deviation so that it is smooth okay So this is the the, the the handles. Now select fill icon to close this two portion. So click close icon, click here, this close contour mean it have a close profile, click for view and OK. And on the other side and click here and then we can pan over here click the fill surface select the profiles preview and click ok so it is now closed make it asymmetric click on in next select join icon so we need to join this icon so that we can proceed with close surface icon the surface tools to make it solid so we need to join it you cannot uh, do close surface without joining it so for just now we have made three surface one two and three preview okay so it just join all the surfaces that we have created so let's move to part design here you can see we have close the face click ok so it is now converted to close the face so if you see like this you just I am just uh, click it this line so I click this line again so that it activate hide and show alright so this is the surface uh, I mean the solid so in next video we'll continue to make the other parts of the screwdriver.